Do you own an international company and want to do transactions in no time? We have the solution for you. In this video, we will explain you all you need to know about offshore banking in Portugal. At Crimerman, we offer holistic legal strategies to successful entrepreneurs and investors to reduce their tax bill, grow wealth overseas, and become global citizens. Opening a European bank account provides stability, access to diverse financial services, favorable interest rates, and seamless international transactions, offering global financial opportunities and security. Why Portugal? As a popular expat destination, Portugal attracts retirees from Northern Europe and North America seeking warm weather and affordable living. With a similar climate to Spain, Portugal offers a relatively low cost of living and a higher standard of English fluency. Portugal boasts a balanced, multi-sector economy that encompasses services, heavy industry, agriculture, forestry, and fishing. Its central bank is the Banco de Portugal. It is regulated by the European Central Bank. If you are interested in getting information about offshore banking, we recommend you also to watch this video. Banking Overview Many Portuguese banks cater to non-residents and allow registration with a foreign address. However, some are exclusive to Portuguese residents or citizens, requiring careful consideration for prospective customers. Most Portuguese banks offer online and mobile banking, with some providing remote account opening options. However, obtaining a Portuguese tax number NIF number, is necessary for opening a bank account. Portugal is part of the Single Euro Payments Area CEPA, facilitating easier international money transfers within Europe. There may be additional fees for transfers outside Europe. How to open a bank account in Portugal To open a basic, current account in Portugal, you will need 1. Valid ID, such as your passport 2. Proof of address A recent utility bill 3. A NIF number, Portuguese tax number The NIF number is essential for various transactions in Portugal and obtaining it should be a priority for non-residents. As bureaucracy in Portugal can be complex, Seeking expert assistance can streamline the process. If you like our content, subscribe to our channel to be aware of more videos like this one. So you can become a part of our community, it would be a big help for us and a small effort for you. What are the major Portuguese banks? Portugal's history as a global trading nation has contributed to a significant banking sector. Some notable Portuguese banks include Activo Bank, a private bank operated by the Millennium BCP Group, offering digital banking services and crypto-friendly accounts. Banco de Investimento Global by G. A privately owned bank headquartered in Lisbon, providing retail, private, and corporate banking. Banco Montepio, a private Portuguese bank offering investment products and crypto-friendly accounts. Banco Portugues de Investimento BPI, one of the largest banks in Portugal, owned by Spain's Caixa Bank and offering a wide range of services, Caixa Gerald de Depositos, a state-owned bank in Lisbon, the largest in Portugal, offering retail, corporate, and private banking services. Millennium BCP, the largest private bank in Portugal, providing retail, commercial, and private banking, along with real estate and insurance services. International banks in Portugal. In addition to local banks, several global banking giants operate in Portugal. A banca, a Spanish-owned bank with retail, commercial, financing, investment, and insurance services. Banco Santander Tata, a Portuguese commercial bank owned by Spain's Banco Santander, offering retail, private, and corporate banking. Barclays Bank, a British bank offering investment banking services in Lisbon. BMP Paribas, with offices in Lisbon and Porto, it provides commercial and investment services. CD Portugal, the Lisbon-based office of the American Citigroup Bank, specializing in corporate and investment banking. So, if you would like to talk through your options and gain a better understanding with regards offshore banking we've covered in today's video, get in touch. In the description below, you will find a link where you can book a call with us, just schedule the day and time you want or leave us a comment.